Ooh, this is really cool. Oh, that hurts. Lo Mako Here we go. Here's another <gasps> What are we gonna Oh that's a goat. We don't need to harm any any innocent unarmed goats. Wow. This is cool. We're going even higher and higher on the mountain side. Oh, did I kill that goat? I swear I didn't kill that goat. <gasps> oh, I didn't kill the goat. I kind of want to take the hide, though. You never know. I might need that in my home. By the way, speaking of my home... Oh, if we jump down there, we'd be in such trouble. Speaking of... Oh, 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 oh. oh in my home... My hearthfire is home. I need to work on that, because I'd like to get married. <gasps> Uh-oh. Hi. We get it? Take your expensive ingredients. Here's some more Lord Mako. Look, Mako! Look, Mako! Actually, we should look and see what those words are. I think it'll tell me. Uh-oh, we got we got trouble up ahead. <gasps> Hi. You're ancient. Oh, this is bad. Oh, we'll be fine. Take that, ancient Atronac. I don't even know how to... Uh... Ooh, Frost Salts. How do you say this guy's name? Ancient Frost Atronach. Atronach. <laughs> Alright, we're going to see a few dangers here on the path, but I think we're going to be okay. Nice. Okay, just be on our best, best alert. Alert, guarded alert. Hold on, I want to see how to say this. Shout. Usually it tells you. Uh, I guess it doesn't. Tragic. Gotta wait for it to recharge. Look, Mako! Look, Mako! <laughs> That's cool. Wow, we are so high up above the earth. I'm a little nervous about meeting this Parthenax dude. I wonder how old he is. Guess we're about to find out. <gasps> it's beautiful up here. Hi, Goaty Goat. What's it like living up here? Oh, jeez. Should have asked so soon. Oh, man. Yes, please. Oh, sounds like I'm hungry. Oh, I'm thirsty and hungry. Let's take care of that. Apple, cabbage, stew, and water. Maybe a tomato. That took care of it. We're not too tired. Another barrier. Piece of cake. Okay, I think we're getting near the top, perhaps. Any other surprises? Ooh, it's cold up here. Oh, let me make sure I'm wearing my best, best warm armor. Oh, let's see. Uh, this one. Full exposure protection. And anything else I want to wear? Let's put the hood on, too. Full exposure protection. Much better. Let's see what I look like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Parthenox is going to think I look so good. Maybe. <laughs> oh, man. We got a ways to go here. It's bitter cold. How about these graphics, man? Looks like we might have one more barrier there. There's another goat, which I will not drag and shout off the side of a mountain. Even though I'm really tempted to do it. This has got to be the final barrier, because it's shaped like the one at the very bottom. Take that, biting wind. All right, we are almost here, I believe. Let's put our weapon away. We don't want to scare this guy. Throw of the world. We made it to the throat of the world. It's 
beautiful up here. <gasps> what? That's Parthenox? Drem Yolok. Greetings, Wundunik. Cool voice. I am Parthenax. Ah, oh, hi. Who are you? What brings you to my Strunmach, my mountain? This guy's cool. This is amazing. Parthenax is a dragon. I think you already know who I am. Yes. Vaza, you speak true, Dovakin. Forgive me. <laughs> it has been long since I held Tinvak with a stranger. I gave in to the temptation to prolong our speech. I never said I wanted to hold your Tinvak. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, why live alone on a mountain if you love conversation? Let's talk to this guy. There are many know hungers it is better to deny than to feed. Mm. Oh, he's a nice dragon. Drechni nakib. Discipline against the lesser aids in kachnar. Denial of the great. Is this guy speaking Kling Klingon? Sounds like he's Tell speaking me, Klingon. <laughs> why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? Well... <laughs> Crazy story, but I need to learn the dragon wrench out. Can you teach me? Hmm. Drem. Patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the dove. Oh, are we both dove? Are we dove buddies? By long tradition, the elder speaks first. Hear my thum. Feel it in your bones. Uh oh, is this gonna hurt? Match it if you are Dova King. He's gonna shout at me. I think we're about to shout at each other. Oh, hi. I have spoken. The Rotmulag waits. Oh, we're gonna learn this word of power. Learn the word of power from Parthenax. Is it right there? Hi. The word calls you. Go to it. It looks like it's on fire. A gift, Dovah Oh, nice. Yo, understand fire as the dove do. Oh, this is cool. I don't... I'm never gonna have to use any of my saved up dragon shadow power. It's fine. Okay, do I equip it now? Now, show me what you can do. Greet me not as mortal. But as Dova. Nice. Your wish is my command. Okay, which one did we just learn? Fire breath? Is that the one we just learned? Fire breath. Yeah, it is. Oh, we still don't know the final one, though. It would be nice to learn it. I believe that's the one that we need to use on him. All right, you asked for it, man. He wants me to breathe on him with my dragon breath. <laughs> Come, Dova King. All right, all right, all right. Strike Patience, buddy. With the fire of your thumb. Okay, here we go. Ah, yes. <laughs> you like that? <laughs> the dragon blood runs strong in you. We are brothers. It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. Right, we're warming up to this guy. No pun intended. So, you have made your way here to me. Yes. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dova Sos, dragon blood. That's me, all right. What would you ask of me? Well, I kind of already asked it, but I guess if you're going to make me ask again, can you teach me the dragon wrench out? Ah, I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Tinvak with an old Dova. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. Yes. Well, the Greybirds didn't want me to come at all. Mm, yes, they are very protective of me. Balan Fadon. But I do not know the thum you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. 
Your kind, Jaw, mortals, created it as a weapon against well, we the Dove, created it. the dragons. I did not know that. Well, of course I didn't know that. Our How could I know that? Our minds cannot even comprehend its concepts. How can I learn it then? Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Right, this is important. Why do you want this to learn this doom? What are my options here? I like this world. I don't want it to end. Ruza, as good a reason as any. There are many who feel as you do, although not all. Not the Greybeards. Some would say that all things must end so that the next can come to pass. <laughs> Perhaps this world is simply the egg of the next Kalpa, Lean Vokin? Would you stop the next world from being born? The next world will have to take care of itself. Paz, a fair answer. Rofus, maybe you only balance the forces that work to quicken the end of this world. Could be. Even we who ride the currents of time cannot see past time's end. Wulsetid los trahodis. Those who try to hasten the end may delay it. Those who work to delay the end may bring it closer. That is wisdom. But you have indulged my weakness for speech long <laughs> enough. Croesus, now I will answer your question. He likes talking to me. Mm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monaven, what you name Throat of the World? Well, I'm guessing... Dragons like mountains? Mm, true, but few now remember that this was the very spot oh, where Alduin was really? defeated by the ancient tongues. That's amazing. Varucht Unslad. Perhaps none but me now remember how he was defeated. Huh. Using the dragon red shout, correct? Mm, yes and no. Viknus Nikron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was, you would not be here today seeking to defeat it's him. That's true. That is true. The Nords of those days used the Dragonrend shout to cripple Alduin. But this was not enough. Oak Mulag mm. Unslad. So it only cripples him. It was the Kel, ah. the Elder Scroll. They used it to, Do I need to find cast him adrift on the currents of time. Interesting. Are you saying that the ancient Nords sent Alduin forward in time? Mm, not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. Maye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day he would surface. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, Ooh. but not when. This is really cool. So, what's an Elder Scroll? Hmm, how to explain in your tongue? The Dove have words for such things that Jaw do not. It is an artifact from outside time. It does not exist, <laughs> but it has always it exist, existed. Rahwatlan, they are mm, 
fragments of creation. I don't get the it. Kelly, Elder Scrolls, as you name them. The Kelly. They Kelly? have often been used Kelly Ripper? for prophecy. Yes, your prophecy comes from an Elder Scroll. Oh, I was prophesied by an Elder Scroll. But this is only a small part of their power. Zofa Suyek. How does this help me? Tid Krent. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. Okay. If you brought that Kel, that Elder uh, Scroll, need to go find back Elder here Scroll. to the Tid Ahran, the Time Wound, with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to uh, cast yourself go back, back in time and learn to Dragon the other Land. end of the break. Interesting. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. Wow, that's epic. Do you know where I can find an Elder Scroll? Krosis. No, I know little of what has passed below in the long years I have lived here. This is cool. We're going to find an Elder Scroll. You are likely better informed than I. That's amazing. Who would know? Esbrenner, Esbrenner Arngear might have some idea. Trust your instincts, Dovahkiin. Your blood will show you the way. Amazing. Truly amazing. This is exciting. The plot thickens. All right, let's see. All right, we're good. Drem your look. Greetings. Hmm? Wait, I was about to say goodbye. What do I do with the Elder Scroll when I find it? Return it here to the Tid Ahran. Then, Kelly Vomindok. Nothing is certain with such things. But I believe the scroll's bond with the Teed Ahran will allow you a... a seeing, a vision of the moment of its creation. Got it. Then you will feel no Dragonrend in the power of its first expression. Amazing. You will see them... Wuth Fadon, my friends, Haken, Dragon Buddies, Feldir. Interesting. Who are they? The first mortals. Oh, they're not Dragon Buddies. The they're Thum, people. The first tongues. The leaders of the rebellion against Alduin. Also, he taught them the Dragon language. They were mighty in their day, even to attempt to defeat Alduin. Sahrot Hun. The Nords have had many heroes since. What about me? But none greater. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, well, can I leave now? Look, Thum. We'll ask him those other questions later. Goodbye. He's a majestic, isn't he? Look, oh, he's going to land right there. This is where he chills. Okay. Guess he felt like flying. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> Alright, Parthenax. Thanks, man. Thanks for the info. I do appreciate it. Alright. Well, we have an epic quest on our hands here. It's time to find the Elder Scroll. It's amazing. I'm so tired. Oh, there's Gore. Hey, buddy, I'm back. I'm tired and somewhat hungry. You ready to go? What do you need? I need you to follow me. About time, friend. Here I was thinking I was going to have to kill something without you. <laughs> Let's go kill things, buddy. All right. Where are we going to kill today? Whatever you want, man. Force yeah, sure. Swarm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Imperial yeah. storm cloaks. Sure. So many choices, so hard to choose. And that, my friend, is what makes murdering beautiful. Options. What? You're sick in the head, Gore. But you're still my friend. All right. So, 
We have some choices to make here. Oh, is Arn Gear over here? Okay, so we can either talk to Arn Gear apparently, or we can talk to Esbern. Well, I say Arn Gear so by the light of the sun sunrise. The dragon blood burns bright within you. Did he tell you what you wanted to know? Did he teach you the dragon rend? Oh, now you want to know all about it? No, but he told me how to find out. Oh, so be it. If he believes it is necessary for you to learn this. We will bow to his wisdom. That's right. So, now I kind of need your help, the little beard. I need the Elder Scroll the agents used. Do you know where to find it? We have never concerned ourselves with the scrolls. Oh, great. The gods themselves would rightly fear to tamper with such things. Mm -hmm. As for where to find it, such blasphemies have always been the stock and trade of the mages of Winterhold. I have to go talk to the mages of Winterhold. They may be able to tell you something about the Elder Scroll. You see. I'm sure they will. All right, well, completed optional tech to Iron Gear. Let's go. Breath and focus. Whatever that means. I mean, breath and focus. All right, how about a couple red apples? Very good. All right. Gore. I think we need to go take a sleep, sleep, sleepity sleep. A little nappy pie inside of this place, which I don't remember the name of. Let's go, man. I'm so tired. And then, let's see, let's get the journal. Uh, we can go talk to the, uh, we can go talk to the mages. Winterhold. Let's get the map. Um, oh, up here. Learn the location of the Elder Scroll. Interesting. Do I still need to talk to Asburn? Hmm. I don't think I need to talk to Asburn. Alright. Alright. Gore and I have made it all the way to Windhelm. Look how beautiful that is. Look at this beautiful, beautiful Nordic town. Hey, buddy. It's time to get some sleep. Look, I am hungry, thirsty, and in need. Desperate, desperate need of sleep. So let's uh, let's eat some of this braided bread. And then drink a little bit. I took care of my uh, food and water needs. But it's time to sleep. All right, guys. Uh, let's do that. And then what we're going to do is I'm going to take the journey up the coast, up the snowy, snowy coast. Learn the location of the Elder Scroll to the Mages Guild, which I don't really want to do because I don't trust magic users. I trust a guy with a hammer on his back. I trust a guy with a shield and sword on his back. But I don't trust magic users. I never have. And I never will. Alright, buddy, let's go.